Ryan is finally here. I'm so excited. And so am I. And I'm so sure we all of us are. A very warm welcome to all respected dignitaries, our guiding light, honorable <coughs> principal sir, respected parents, and our DCIS family. Now, I would request respected Anil sir, our school administrator, to join us on stage and greet the gathering. Very good afternoon to all, uh, respected principal sir, vice principal ma'am, parents and my dear uh, staff. This is a wonderful occasion for us because uh, generally when we think of annual day, we think of you know dance uh, in a group on the stage and all which is hardly 2-3 minutes and then the children go away. But here what we are actually trying to do is give the children a platform where they can perform. It is not just performance, they are required to learn the script, their timing has to be proper, their expression has to be proper, they are required to coordinate with a large number of children. So, uh, for us it is more like language development and extension of language development. For the children, it is of course uh, a part of their uh, learning skills and for you, definitely what could be better than your children performing something here on stage. In fact, everything that you see on stage, the props, the costume, everything is managed by the kids as you must have seen in the video. The children were part of this entire process. So we divided the children into two parts. One was the performing group and the other one was the technical group. So the technical group made everything. The performing group is going to present it here uh, in front of you. We as a school also have done some changes. If you have visited this AV room earlier, you would have seen the setup has slightly changed. It used to be a smaller stage, now we have a larger stage. There are lights, there is a sound console, there is a, you know, a green room. All these changes are done because we wanted the children to get an authentic you know, idea of how theatre works. Right? So that is the, the quest that we have and uh, children have you know, performed wonderfully well from what we have seen in the rehearsals and all and I'm sure they will be performing here uh, absolutely wonderfully. There are some things that we request al already in the uh, voiceover it was mentioned. Please do not talk in between because uh, the children are not going to use any mics. So if someone talks, you know, that gets disturbed. Uh, so for one, don't talk. Second one, please do not take any photographs or uh, use the mobiles while you are uh, while the play is on, because again it disturbs your children. So it's better that that is not done. The other part is that after the show, a small refreshment is arranged in A block. We request all of you to be part of that, so that the children get some time to remove their makeup, remove the costumes, and then they will join you in A block while you are having your refresh refreshment. Also. Uh, as I mentioned, you know, the regular annual day would have been a song and dance evening kind of a thing. But uh, since we are changing the format a little bit, we have uh, made a small feedback form. Now in A block when you go, you will find a QR code there. Kindly scan it, give us a feedback so we also come to know where we can improve or how was the work that we have done. Right? So please take just two minutes, it may take hardly two minutes for you to fill these forms and uh, you know, give us a feedback. So once again, and of course the children will be going with you back home. So uh, once again, let us enjoy the theater fiesta uh, that is going to be performed by grade six kids. Thank you. Thank you, Anita. On this special and remarkable occasion, we would like to extend our heartfelt welcome to all of you on this special event of Theatre Fiesta 2023. It is on the novel Hatchet, written by Gary Paulson. Let me give you a little glimpse of Hatchet. Hatchet is a novel about a 13-year-old boy named Ryan Dawson. He meets to a plane crash and gets lost. He finds himself completely alone in the Canadian wilderness. With his only tool, his Hatchet. He struggles for his survival after the plane crash. But at last, he finds a rescue after the wilderness by the pilot. Wow! Surviving on his own with the <coughs> only tool hatchet sounds so thrilling and adventurous. I can't resist to be the witness of his story. But hold on, haven't you forgotten something? 
Oh yes! How can we proceed without them? So here is a great surprise for you. Are you ready? I know. You must have been taken by the surprise. By looking at the background, settings, props, costumes and everything you see on the stage. There were some hands behind the scene who have worked so artistically to come alive this event. They are none other but our star technical team striving so hard to make this event the most fascinating and successful. Introducing our star technical team. Oh, 
both here and visit your father during vacation. Order. 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 The goat is adjourned. Don't worry, sir. We'll have a great time this vacation. We will go, go fishing, watch television. Also, it will be a first time in Canada. Yes. One must stay motivated. No matter how hard it gets. Always look at yourself. Including you. Repeat after me. You're the best asset you could ever have. Look. Can't we talk this over? Can't we talk this out? Please, tell me what is going on. And so do I. I love you. I love you very oh. much. It's a new beginning. You, me, and Bright are going to have a fresh oh. start. I promise. We will have a great time together. Oh, oh. not so hard, kiddo. Gently. Take her life. Take her life. See, there you go. Now turn the wheel a little to the right and push the right rudder pedal. All of flying is easy. Just takes learning like everything else. You are quite a learner. See, you almost got that. I know your secret, Brian. I know your secret. It's a big secret. You can't tell anyone. Your mother is having a secret lover. She is sending you away to your father to live with him. He will not see you ever again. I know your secret, Brian. Evos. 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 No matter. How hard it gets. Always look at yourself. My cycle is better than yours. My mother is better than yours. My life is much better than yours. Don't worry, sir. We'll go, go fishing, watch television, just you and me. Papa. Order. 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 The court is adjourned. Darling, you should do this more often. Oh. You know I can't, my love. You must. You know. Oh. You will be much happier with oh. me. Leave him. Come with me. What about Brian? Well, bring him along. He will oh. be one big happy oh. family. Aren't you a charmer? Oh.
running it also wonders so beautiful that pocketing for a moment that is a flower hello i i feel thirsty can i drink this lake water i have seen people do this in films but this water seems muddled with a plain wreck and not to mention the pilot and these bugs there must be a clean patch here i'll just try a little bit all right i am thirsty
three times. Tomorrow or day after? 
so they will come for it too. It's a bit very long. Let's. <laughs> These mosquitoes wouldn't let me sleep oh. in peace. Hamburgers, please, someone give me hamburgers. Good morning, Mr. Puppet. Good morning, kids. Sit down. So, kids, what did we learn from this book? It's very important to stay positive in life. Yes, one must be motivated, no matter how hard it gets. Now, look at your assets carefully. Including you. Repeat after me. You are the best asset you have. You are the best asset you have. You are the best asset you have. Huh? Stupid, stupid, stupid! I must eat something. But what? I have seen in some TV shows that in such situation, people even eat lizards. Ew! Gross! They use a glass or crystal to trap the sun rays. Oh! I could use my watch to catch the sun rays. But it's broken. It's useless. <coughs> Even if we wanted to eat lizards, there haven't been any lizards around. Lizard! What else could we eat? Oh! Berries. There weren't some berry bushes around. That is easy to say. Where are they? Maybe we can chase the birds. They might need to put the berries. Maybe this? Hi. No. Hi, no. Definitely not that one. Maybe this? No. No. There you are. Right, red berries. Yes. I want more! Oh, stop! <coughs> I guess that's enough. Oh. Ooh, Finally, baby. I could eat some food in peace! <coughs> yup, that was so bad! But I'm so hungry! <coughs> I would just eat the berries, that's an all. I miss my family so much. <coughs> Last time giving was so perfect. <coughs> At last, 
last night was awfully windy. Lucky that my shelter was sturdy enough. Even the mosquitoes stay that way. But I have seen that some trees have snapped to the ground. I must check if there is any food on them. Oh look, there are some bushes with something red on them. What could that be? Raspberries! My goodness! Is he sure? I wouldn't be so sure about it. In a jungle, you are more likely to become food than find some. Don't say that. Oh, such sweet, sweet juice. Yes. Okay. 
Bob to make fire. But how? I must make a home for these sparks to stay. There's short in it nest for the fire. But how will it stay? We need wood to make it stay. Wilderness, 
I thought I was put in a whole different world. The crash, the isolation, the fear was all so overwhelming. But then something amazing started to happen. Little by little, I started to figure things out. After 54 days in the wilderness, Brian Robson's rescue marked the turning point in his survival story. The hatchet, now a relic of his survival, felt heavier in his hand as he stepped out of the wine, leaving behind a chapter etched with resilience and echoing with the lessons of Mother Nature.
a good time <coughs> always flies. But we are sure you had a great time and enjoyed the fruits of hard work done by all these little wonders. As we come to the end of this event, we would like to extend our heartfelt gratitude to the team Footlight. Beloved Gauri ma'am, Abhra sir, Amar sir, Purva ma'am, Harshal sir, Sunal sir and Vibhanshu sir for their guidance and support. On this occasion, we thank all parents who took their valuable time to be part of this event and make it successful. And the last, but not the least, we thank all dear participants who tried their best to showcase this wonderful play. Finally, we would like to thank the entire DCI's family for their perennial support to make this event a successful one. Now, we have come to the end of this event. Thank you all. As you have seen, the children perform. I guess they have done a wonderful work. Yes. Please give a huge round of applause. As you already mentioned, everything that you saw on stage, whether it is the prop or the costumes, everything is done by the children. And uh, you know, at the beginning, we were also wondering how things will work out. But the way it has come together, really makes us feel very proud that we have such a wonderful talented uh, group of children here and thanks to all of you for your continued support as the children already mentioned some refreshment is arranged in block a the children themselves will require around 15 to 20 minutes to take off the makeup give the costumes and then join you in block a so we request you to proceed to block a also the children will be going back with you so just remember that uh, again just a reminder QR codes are already put up in block A. It will hardly take two minutes for you, but for us, it would be a wonderful feed time. So thank you all for being part of the theater fiesta.